Good morning, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to another piano tutorial video. Today, we are going to be looking at Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. This version is for easy piano, both hands. So we have, we are going to dissect this a little bit, kind of break it down, and then put everything back together. So we'll start with the road map, then the right hand, then the left hand, and then both hands together, finally. So what we're going to do is we will start with um, our road map. So we are going to start at the beginning of the piece, we do have a first and second ending structure. So what that means is we will play through that first ending, repeat back to the beginning, and then we will go through again. Second time we will, we will skip that first ending, go straight into the second page, and then play through all the way to the end. Now for the right hand part, one thing we do have to be cautious about is uh, moving finger position. So I'm going to model that for you here on the keys. Um, but as always, if you do have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Um, so I'm going to start at the beginning and just play through to the end, and then we'll go over the left hand part. Starting with a second finger on the G above middle C, or G4, okay? Repeat back to the beginning. So that is the right hand part. So the biggest thing I'm going to be cautious about, so we start here, and then everything's going to shift to the left. And then we go through that again. Second ending, we shift up so our first finger is on G. And then we also are going to cross over. So that's going to be third finger over, and then under for D. Alrighty, so let's, uh, I think that was it on the right hand. And then we, of course, repeat that opening phrase again um, to close. Alrighty, so we're in the C five finger position in our left hand. So let's go ahead and cycle through. Nice job, everybody. So um, the biggest thing with this one, I do use a different fingering that's than that's listed in the music. So that's going to be measures three and four. So it's going to start on five and then two, three, four, three, one, two, one. That again, uh, starting at measure three. So that's five, two, three, four, three, one, two, one. Alrighty, are you ready to put both hands together? Let's try it. So I'm going to take it slow and then I'll just, uh, we'll just uh, go over anything we need to at the end. So we have finger five on C in the left hand, finger two on G. 